Hello there YouTubers, welcome to, back to my channel, Workshop Fun. I just wanted to show you the latest update on my welder. Um, I've made a little stand for it quickly. Um, I've been turning around and making some new welding leads up. I'm just waiting for the new electrode and earth clamp to come and terminal clamps. Um, but the other thing I brought not long ago for the welder was this um, robust 80 amp three phase switch. I'm just using it as a single phase. Um, so the phase wire is going through it. And um, that was quite easy to rig up. I've just had that metal box off the back and attached the switch to that and then ran the wires up through that um, so that now cuts out the active wire or phase wire now just to show you that it is definitely indeed working there you go and that just will sit there at about 89, 90 that's the lowest amperage um, setting for the welder okay now when of course I want to turn it off done um, this welder never originally had an on and off switch on it um, let me just focus there some welders do other welders don't but I kind of like the idea of having an on and off switch at, at the welder as well so if I want to put my gear down on the bench and I don't want to accidentally put the electrode down on some metal that's earthed I can just turn it off and adjust my work and then turn it back on um, the other thing I got coming for this soon is just a couple of litres of um, transformer oil I don't think it needs a couple of litres probably more like 500 mil maybe a litre um, just over the years it must have been on the back of somebody's ute or something like that and it's lost some of its oil so I'll be topping it back up I won't be doing a complete oil change on it though because the oil is still in very good order so I can't see any point but yeah well that's about all for now um, yeah, if you liked this video, please hit the like, and if you wish to, please subscribe. Thank you very much.